guys, it is your boy Hotshot Gaming here, and today we are back with another day of the daily racing back on the track that I'm good at, Daily Race A. Starting in the good second place position as I got a better qualifying time, um, managing to get me up in them Todd spots, and we're starting off, like I said, in second place. Starting off with a pretty good start, managing to sort of get the hang of the way that the car sets off <clears throat> on the immediate set off point, as we were having trouble in our previous races uh, with um, this car off the starting grid. So, as I said again, we're starting off pretty well in second position. Um, trying to get uh, away from the following drivers that are behind us um, trying to get to push for the top spot position on the first race as we come on as it is the uh, <clears throat> before the new set of daily races come up next week hopefully I'm, we're going to have some good tracks next week some tracks that I'm good at if not I will have to do some practicing to build up my driver rating. So as we're on the second lap now, still currently in second place, trying to keep up with first position as we are slightly faster in the first section as Red Bull Racer has got the fastest time at the moment, following by trying to keep up with Slipstream um, here to try and gain um, first place. Um, as we're trying very, very hard as we approach the final corner, coming on to the final, uh, on to, uh, to go over onto our third lap. And plus, as you'll see on one of my videos uh, in this race of, the, of this video, you'll see the guy that decided he wanted to be a complete ass to me, which downgraded my SR sportsmanship rating which was very annoying as you'll see that in one of my races um but yeah back to the race here still in second position as we're coming up near to the halfway point of lap three um still keeping up with red bull racer yeah he was pretty fast he was pretty fast around the track but we managed to keep up with him as much as possible um, trying to use the track limits as much as possible on the final turn there on race A as we approach onto the fourth lap now coming down the straightaway uh, as we see Red Bull Racer literally going so much speed down that corner as we approach this corner and Red Bull Racer has gone wide giving us the opportunity to come in with the first position now as we are on lap for gaining us the position there, gaining us the open there to be able to approach as we have the fastest time. Look at this. We have the fastest time of a 51.470. So we've managed to gain the fastest lap as well at this moment in time. Bam. Look at that. You know, uh, we, we know this track. We know this track, boys. We know this track. As we approach the final corner, to coming into lap five now. This is intense. I'm in first place. I was shaking, not going to lie, but I had to keep my intentions on the wheel. I had to keep myself, you know, um, relaxed. Otherwise, I was going to lose this first position. Not not many times I'll stay and get first on this fucking game. So, yeah, with these guys being so good. So, yeah. So, I've skipped it to the final lap of the race as we kept first place for the whole of the rest of the laps. And, um, and basically, yeah, I got the win on that race. Was very happy with that. Very happy indeed that I got that win. Um, as we obviously approach the final corner coming up. And bang, straight in first place. Look at that, look at that. And then as we get the victory here, I've only got seven wins. I know it's not many, but it's a fucking win. It's a win, and I'm happy. Yeah. So as we come on to our next race, this race was the race where it didn't go well. It went all downhill. 
it went all downhill. We had the dude that decided he wanted to just completely break right as I'm behind him. Right as I'm right like behind him, dude. And he, he just decides he wants to he just wants to slam his brakes and I go straight into him. Like I he he, he really annoyed me. He absolutely annoyed me so much. So as the green card, the British guy, punted the TG out of the way. And I think the guy in the green um, Volkswagen, I, I, I think he did hit me um, at the back. But he blamed it on the the guy that's in fifth place. This The guy in fifth is the guy that decided he wanted to slam his brakes and just keep doing it literally just keep doing it like when he didn't have to do it like when he did not have to do it like like i don't care if people say oh he's brake checking you dude like no he was i thought he was just breaking just where you didn't have to break I, I don't understand like and then he's just like you're welcome i was like why are you just breaking like that like it's ridiculous so it just didn't go well and i'm in seventh now the, the the two cars, I believe the British guy and the the guy, so the Peugeot and the green Volkswagen guy, they were fighting. He knocks, it, the Peugeot guy knocks the Volkswagen dude off the track um, as we're slowly coming back um, and gaining our positions. Right, so the Peugeot guy goes off track and now the English guy behind me decides that he wants to just bang straight into me at the back, knocks me off track, and he was like, he was, it, it was like, that wasn't my fault. I was like, bullshit, that was your fault. You went straight into me, he knocks me off track. I'm like, what the fuck right now? And then I have to catch up. So they've gone off track. They're fighting like fuck. Look at these guys, fighting like hell. So obviously the Persia dude's probably not the fucking dude off of the Volkswagen. I'm having a break to try and... To, to go around, do some zigzag shit, fuck, trying to get around here, this was, this was mental, dude, so, trying to, trying to race clean now, um, I don't think the, the English guy gave me any problem anymore, um, but I don't think he meant to hit me off track like that, but them two were just fighting it like, fuck, I think the English dude gave up in the end, or he's coming back, so he's gone wide, and I'm like, right, okay, I've gained another position, I'm in ninth place, I need to try and Gain more positions now. So now we have fuck dickhead in front. <coughs> um, trying to catch up to him, his bitch ass. And right, fast forward to the video. Look at this. Right behind him, behind him, behind him. Doesn't need to break. Doesn't need to break. Boom. Breaks. Boom. What the fuck? Don't need to break. SR goes down. So I'm like, right, okay, what is he doing? Never mind. Carry on with the race. Right, so I'm carrying on with the race, going for the slipstream, because obviously I need to catch up. It gets a it gets a penalty. It gets a penalty. So I'm like, right, okay. Gets a penalty. That's good. But his SR didn't go down. And he didn't even get any more penalties, neither. When he kept doing the same shit. So coming around the corner, trying to gain the slipstream to catch up. Trying to get gain the position. Going around as normal. You think normal, right? I'm like, right, this guy's got a penalty. I might as well just stay behind him, right? Boom, brakes. Don't even need to brake. Don't even need to brake. I'm sorry I'm shouting, but don't even need to brake. SR goes down again. I'm like, right, I need to try and do something. This guy is deliberately doing bullshit right now. So I need to go behind him again to catch up to the slipstream. I'm like, right, penalty coming up. And it's not long enough because the lap ends and this dude is an absolute cunt. Yeah. So these guys pissed me off, these two. I put Dick, right? He, 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 the, the, the one other guy annoyed me a lot. The Volkswagen dude, I just wasn't happy because I'd, he might have not intentionally hit me at the back. But he did. He did hit me. Then I put, uh, thanks for taking my SR down by just breaking hard. So pretty much he was breaking intentionally, um, bullshit and whatever, which really annoyed me. And yeah. And then look at this guy. He puts no problem. 
no problem. And then he does a smiley face after. So after that, I calmed down and I kept on racing. And I was happy because I got first place. But at the same time, I was pissed because that dude just did that. And I said to myself, if I ever bump into him again, I'm not racing against him. But lucky enough, for the rest of the night, I didn't bump into him. So it was really good. And everything felt good after that. And eventually, that night, I managed to get my SR back up to S again. Literally on the tip of the iceberg. But this race was a really good race. I enjoyed this race between the German guy and me. It was a very good race. It was a pretty good battle. He, he was really good at defending. But um, unfortunately, he, um, he went wrong on one of the turns, which cost him the slip of the first place. But overall, this race parked me back up because it was a very good race. And a very clean race. And I was very happy. I managed to get, you know, managed to just calm down. Because it's one of those. If you get too angry in a race, you're just going to fuck yourself up. That's how I think of it anyway. I was maybe different. But, yeah, that last race just annoyed me. So I thought, right, I'm going to stay on. I'm going to work on my SR. Get that back up. As well as working on my driver rating at the same time so so i thought i'd skip it to the to the final lap because i was pretty much in second place for the whole of it so um so basically we're on this final stretch i thought i wasn't going to be able to get him i thought he was actually going to win but as we go on the outside we managed to get in and get the turn i managed to actually um take over the german guy it was uh, it was a really good race actually because we were just we were so close to each other, but unfortunately um, I managed to get the turn on the outside there and just managed to be able to slip in and gain the first position uh, on the final lap. But like I said, I thought I wasn't actually going to win. I thought the German was going to have it all the way there, but um, as soon as I knew, I managed to have the the final. Uh, the final slip to get to him on the final lap. It was just so good. So good to get that win. And just it parked me back up. Made me happy. So final race. Um, to finish off. Uh, this one was pretty crazy. Um, it didn't start off too well. Uh, starting in first place. And I actually had to do a bit of work on this one. So we're starting off. With a shitty sort sort of uh, so so shitty start, the Ge the German guy that we managed to beat last race actually got very lucky, um, as I went in a bit too much and accidentally tapped the guy that was on my right side, trying to get back on the track. But as you can see, that ever all the tr all the people just in the corner they're going crazy, um, and everyone's just doing a little bumpy, 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 a bit crazy on there. Uh, one guy getting a one second penalty um, as uh, we were lucky not to get any penalties on that to be fair but we 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 dropped from first to ninth but lucky enough these guys were should I say I didn't really know much about the track so I actually managed to catch up quite a bit because some of them had lower driver ratings so we managed to um, some of them are breaking on corners that I that I didn't like. I didn't need to break on them, but most of the guys were breaking on the corners that I've never braked on. So most of them didn't really know the track about that much. But as the one British guy goes a bit too far, fast around the corner and slips out. So we've managed to go from ninth to fifth now, catching up to these drivers really really quickly. These guys had like I think they were like in the times of fifty twos uh, and upwards. So they they. You know, I mean, not, I wouldn't say they were experienced drivers, uh, just starting off, you know, um, you know, I wouldn't say I'm an expert, but I'd say I'm average, but, um, you know what I mean? But I was a lot faster than them, put it that way. Um, but yeah, we've managed to, to, to go from, to go from first to ninth, to ninth, to fifth. <laughs> um, 
which isn't too bad as we're managing to gain positions pretty quickly here as we go on on the straightaway on the third lap going around the first corner as the Peugeot goes too far too fast and goes out wide gaining us the position in fourth place uh, as we're on the third lap of the race now trying to take third position French guy in the Audi TT in front of us can we gain second third position as we come across near to the end of a lap three now can we gain that position as we approach the final turn coming on to lap four gaining on the slipstream we're going to try and go for the take we're going for it and we're slowly easing trying to keep the inside the french guy's got it so we back off let him have the turn as he's got it but the french guy's coming around the corner again as we're on the fourth lap so last lap last corner and we managed to go like i said from first to ninth to ninth back to second managing to gather up those places so like i said i hope you guys enjoyed this video guys like i said please like subscribe hit the bell icon you know the notifications even got the fastest lap clean race and yeah just stay tuned for more guys thank you see you later